stopped.
know who played the guitar for this, but like, they did damn good. to this because I don't know the codes because I've done that sat there and not played this for a while. Oh, apparently they have Sally Face without the mask. Well, we will definitely be looking at that. So, like... Alright, so Sally Face answer. Hmm... Getting the guide out of you, page. Third door. What floor are we on? I don't remember. Two. We're on floor two. Okay, so we'll need second floor. So, in, flower, X, flower, hourglass, weird, trapezoid thing, triangle. I'll have to keep that. Up. So... In flower X flower. That's where we need to start. So. Oh, shit, I messed that up. Alright, let's get this first part going. At least. So. In. charging right yep okay thing's always acting like it don't have battery I can get Larry over here too I don't like that the music stopped oh That's our pentagram. Okay, there's a nasty ass tool, a nasty ass tub, nasty ass sink. Charlie was a nasty ass man, so I can uh, understand.
kinds of means. We're gonna leave it up. Shits and noodles. You can't get it as well either. Alright, let me see what the first one door is. So. Hourglass. Trapezoid X. Lightning. Hourglass. Trapezoid, triangle, square, up arrow. That one's gonna be, that one's gonna get me. There's too many repeats. So, hourglass, trapezoid, X, lightning, hourglass. That's the first part. So... Oh, I forgot what it was. Hourglass, trapezoid, X, lightning, hourglass. Okay. So. Believe it was trapezoid thing. Hourglass, trapezoid. Left arrow, square, up arrow. Alright, alright, alright. So, okay, so it's not left arrow. What, what was it? Oh, trapezoid thing again, then left arrow, square, and up arrow. Okay, okay, okay. He's so sorry. Now I now realize what I did. Up arrow, son of a bitch. All right, confirm. So hourglass, trapezoid, X, lightning. Hourglass, trapezoid, left arrow, square, up arrow. Whew. All right, all right, all right. All right, so. Hourglass that trapezoid. Ah, these th type of things always get me, especially on a timer. Trapezoid X lightning hourglass trapezoid left arrow square up arrow. Oh lord, this thing's eating me alive. So Rosenberg's place now? Should have figured that much. Sorry, Mrs. Gibson. The young boy stands at the threshold of oblivion, memorized by the eternal abyss. Uh, okay. by the world of mankind. Prisoner of flesh and bone. Tear it. 
Addison. Mr. Addison, how long have you been like this? No, 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 no. I want to chase that.
My apologies, good sir. I haven't quite been myself, and I've caused so much pain. Is it over now? Almost. I'm afraid there is one more task remaining, and it is a hideous one. Whatever it is, I will do it. Whatever it takes to the end, end this for good. <clears throat> you must kill all those who have been tainted by the dark. My dad, Jug, Larry's mom, whatever that druggy dude's name is. Uh, okay, I don't know where the rest is, but that's everyone in this building. Those are my friends and family. We've cleared the darkness from their souls. We've already saved them. I'm afraid it's too late for them, Sal. Their souls are destroyed beyond repair. It, if left unchecked, the shadows will keep through these cracks and many more lives will be extinguished. My heart weighs heavy in sorrow for you. I know you will lose everything just as I had for many years. I don't think I can do this. Please don't make me do this, Terrence. It is your choice to make. I know it's an extraordinary burden to bear, but I also know that you will do the right thing. I... Fudge bucket. Shoot. Damn. Okay. Well, shit. Now we gotta go kill our family. So much for getting remarried, Dad. Ha <laughs> I'm gonna go stab her. Addison is right, Sal. This must be done. I'm sorry. I wish there were another way. Mrs. Gibson? I don't feel well. Would you help me get to the apart my apartment, please, Sal? Well, we murder motherfuckers tonight. Sally Faze, ha have you sent her little Todd around? We need to talk to him. God, this is... <sighs> Don't think twice. Just stab them all. Hey, dude, glad you decided to come back. Now we can finally get this party started. Well, you weren't gonna go nowhere anyways. Cripple jokes. Hey, ya, Sal. You is feeling alright? I think there's something going around. We just stabbed him right in the heart, like, <laughs> okay. Shit. Oh, we gotta kill the kid. Sowie face. Can I white on your shoulders now? Murder. Well, at least we took the kid out, you know, like right in the heart. I don't notice a trend yet. Oh, I liked this dude. He was cool. What's up, man? You looking a little worse for wear. Everything okay? Was that a under the jaw? That was. Damn, Sally Face. That was hardcore. Murder parents. We're gonna take a moment for these game characters. They're gonna die. Hey, kiddo. There's some leftover lasagna in the fridge if you're hungry. You know, I may not not say this enough, but I'm proud of you, Sally. You've come a long way, and I know it hasn't been easy. You're making this hard, Dad. L I look at you now and I'm excited about the man you're becoming. I think you've got a bright future ahead of you. I really do. I love you, buddy. They're making this so hard. It's ridiculous. Where did we stab her? We got him in the side of the head. I think we did the un under jaw thing with her. Well, at least they died in love. 
Larry, I'm sorry. Oh lord, Larry, I'm sorry. I just killed your mama. Something is wrong. I blacked out in the treehouse and woke up in the temple. They had me tied down. There was something else there. I think it was the demon. This is giving me goosebumps. Like, I'm so, like, upset now. Like, he could have been avoided. We could have avoided killing Todd. But now we can't because he was dragged down to the temple with the demon. They cut me and took some of my blood. There was a loud sound and I passed out again. When I came to, they were gone and I was untied. I don't feel right, Sal. I think I'm dying. You gotta kill Todd. sounded serious so I called the police and rode over there right away. I got there. Hold on guys, my chat just went down. to refresh chat menu. Oh. Why is it white? Why is my chat menu down? Show chat menu. That's better. Should be fine now. Sound is serious, so I called the police and run over there right away. I got there just as the police showed up. On my way to the front door, I saw Todd running into the wood. Oh, shit. I called out for him, but he just kept running. I approached the building, and Sal was standing in the doorway, covered in blood, and just staring out. He was mumbling the same thing over again. I had no choice. I had to do it. There wasn't any other way. I tried to talk to him, but he was unresponsive. The cops pulled me away before I got any closer to him. Sal isn't an evil man. He's not a bad person. He just needs help. Dr. Enan, you handed, handled Mr. Fisher's psychiatric assessment during this time in prison, including several months of therapy sessions. Is this correct? this motherfucker and what have you concluded from your time with the defendant I gotta make sure my mic's good for you guys and what have you concluded from your time with the defendant it is my professional opinion that Sal Fisher is perfectly sane and was while he proceeded to do the murders. <laughs> Occupants of the Addison Apartments, the elaborate story he con. second for you guys. I hope that's better.
Hello? Hello? That is a lot better. Okay. I'm sorry. I didn't know y'all couldn't hear me. Holy shit. Won't be doing that again. Alright. Let's get back to our game. Occupants of Addison Apartments. The elaborate story he coincided is simply that a story. A tale to make him out to be the hero rather than the villain. He was so convincing that I even began to believe his story. I went out to the apartments to visit the treehouse as Sal requested. There was nothing there at all. In fact, the further I poked into his story, the more inconsistencies there were. These inconsistencies, along with all of the contradictory evidence, proved to me that Sal is not delusional, but simply lying to protect himself. That is some fucking bullshit. In your opinion, is Sal Fisher a threat to the public? Absolutely, without a doubt. Whatever. I don't like you, you poofy mustache looking gosh. Members of the jury, have you reached a verdict? Yes, Your Honor, we have reached a verdict. In the case of Sal Fisher versus the County of Knockville, what say you? Ah, oh, they're going to say guilty. The members of this jury find the defendant guilty of first degree mass murder. I agree with the jury on the verdict of guilt, and because of the severity of the crime committed, I hereby sentence Sal Fisher to receive capital punishment. Oh, they're going to execute me. No, you can't do that. He's sick. He needs our help. Order, order on the court. Fucking shit. All right. Ashley had tried in almost every way she could to think of to prevent Sal's execution and failed with each attempt. Now she sits in her living room as the new reveals the bo that today is the day that Sal will be executed. A deep sadness washes over her. It's then that an idea comes to Ash that could change everything, though she'd have to act fast. Oh, I'm getting goosebumps, guys. <laughs> so, <laughs> your girl's gonna come save you. <laughs> Larry, are you here? Please, dude, if you're here, the, the show yourself. We need to help. Sally's in trouble. I bought some of your old music. If this doesn't work, then this is the last time I'm coming up here. Holy fucking shit hey ash you guys were telling the truth this whole time well yeah duh i knew it well i had my doubts obviously but i really really wanted to believe it just don't fall out of the treehouse okay huh never mind how are we gonna help sal oh i have a plan just hold still for a second shit that's bright damn Oh, oh, oh. Yes, I got it. She got a picture. Oh, goosebumps. Come on, let's go. Oh, I can control the bike. Oh, shit. I bet we have to watch out. Come on, come on. I'm coming, Sal. I'm coming, I'm coming, I'm coming. We got to save your ass, bro. Because if you die, like, shit's, shit's going to happen. I don't know what's ahead, so I'm scared to... I'm afraid you're too late, honey. They're strapping him in now. Wait, he was telling the truth. I have proof, please. You have to wait. Just let me show you what I found. Hey. Hey, wait. Oh. Hmm. 
No! I had to gather myself for a moment. Like, that, that killed me inside. <laughs> My favorite characters are all dying. Time of death is 6.33 p.m. Sal, oh god, no. Oh man, I'm so hurt. <laughs> we gotta go kill what's his name, Todd, now. <sighs> Seventy six to two thousand four. I wish you were here, Sal. Sorry I haven't visited in a few nights. Things have gotten worse. It's been five months since Todd escaped from the institution. I hope he's okay. He's gotta be under that darn church. It's one of the other, one of the places we haven't been able to get to. They're down there, I know they are. And they have my Todd. Did you get the rest of that C4 from your army friend? I got it last night, have you found a way in? I think so, yeah, we should go Tuesday night. That's when they're at least active. Remember our agreement, if we get caught down there, we won't. We're going to get Todd and then blow that place to fucking bits. I had to add the fucking in there. I'm sorry. Neil, I'm serious. I'm so sorry. I didn't realize my camera's being a cock bag. Angel. There you go. Must be able to see better. So am I, but if we do get caught, then yeah, we take them down with us. I'm ready. Good, at least one of us is. Gizmo, you need anything? He hasn't left your room since the execution. It's like he knows. Oh, that breaks my heart. Oh, it breaks my heart. Sal was like the favorite. Along with Larry. And they both fucking died. Hey Mabel, how are you today? Neil and I are gonna get Todd back soon. We may have to stick him in with you at least until we can figure out a better solution. I hope you don't mind. I've gotta... I've gotta run out to the shed real quick, but when I get back we'll get you some nice warm soup.
Day one, Mabel has become a threat to herself and others and had to be locked up. Day seven, most of the time Mabel remains conscious and alert. She is grateful that we are working to find a way to help her. Day 11, the corruption seems to be most active at night. Today, we reinforced the cage and added restraints for everyone's safety. Mabel didn't love the idea of restraints, but understood why they were needed. Day 20, the infection is getting worse. We're only able to speak with Mabel about 50% of the time. The rest of the time, she acts like some kind of demon or something, driven by violence. Day 32, Mabel has become difficult to interact with at all, and her physical appearance has begun to change. Day 39, she has started screaming during the night and didn't stop until her throat bled. Day 42, the screaming has continued the past few nights. Luckily, no one lives close enough to hear it, and the basement muffles most of the sound anyway. Day 45, her screaming finally stopped, but she's not looking so great. Day 46, we can't get her to eat anything. Day 51, she's still refusing to eat. We've been force feeding her as much as we can but it's very difficult day 64 mabel is starting to smell pretty bad still not eating she's gonna die she is looking pretty skinny from what she used to be she's pretty uh large in size and now she's skinny Shit, I don't remember. Wait, does she have it? <laughs> well, okay. Okay, that's just all notes. We've got these weird pyramid things in the mail. Another package from our mysterious cultist insider. Todd had a third pyramid in the shed. In his notes, he says he found it in the temple under the old apartments. They seem to be pretty important. There are several mentions of a prophecy in Todd's notes about them. He was actively looking for the other two. I think they might be linked to you somehow. No matter how I turn these, nothing happens. I thought something would happen this time. Sal, there's something else I need to tell you. The replacements were sloppy at first, but they're getting better now. It's harder to tell the difference. I can't trust anyone. Those things creep me out, dude. They aren't human. I know what you mean. So you think that pyramid thing that Todd found could help us find Sal? It seems like it. They've pieced together what I could find out about the old cult prophecies. And from what I can tell, there are three pyramids that will summon their destruction. All sign po signs point to Sal as the one who can stop them. I'm not sure how or why, but it's the best chance we have. I always knew Sally Face would do great things. Don't give up on him, Ash. You have to find him. I won't ever. I just need to find the other two pyramids. Once I'm free from this fucking treehouse, I'll help you find them. Larry, I don't know if this is a good idea. What if burning down the treehouse makes thing only makes things worse? Trust me, it can't get any worse. I can't live like this anymore. Or, y you know, not live, but whatever. I can stay stuck in this place. I can't stay stuck in this place. You don't know what it's like. It's torture. I can feel it changing me. Nothing else has worked to break the binding spell. What if you end up in the black room instead of being free? Your soul will dissolve into the darkness. We don't know that for sure. And even so, the nothing less would be better than existing like this. Please, Ash, you have to help me. If I do this, you have to promise me you'll be okay. Promise me you won't fade away. I promise. You fucking liar! I know you're gonna fucking fade. I 
I'm gonna get sad if we completely lose both Sal and Larry. I went back to the burnt tree house for every night for weeks. He's just gone. I can't bring myself to go anymore. Another screw up in a long list of my failures. This morning I went over to Neil's place, but... Hello, Neil, you home? I grabbed the C4 from Nils bag since we're supposed to go to the temple that night. I'm worried. Shit, how did I know? Everything seems fine in here. So we do gotta go to the front door. Oh, we gonna get it. We gonna get it. So that was West. The Dissension? Are they bringing Sal back? Ah, oh, son of a bitch! I didn't see that motherfucker.
We're gonna go west again. West again. we're supposed to go south. So this is west. We need to go east. We need to somehow get back to east. So west. I swear they always catch me because they're either already moving or some crazy shit. Alright, so he's tall. Three dots. I think we went north, east, west. Now we gotta go south.
Disappointment. Disappointment. I see you don't move. Ah! So we need to go this way first. West Hall. Inner West Hall. Thank you so much for the follow. So we went west, north. Wait. No, I think we went east this time, so we need to go west. Oh, this one's gonna drop. Nope. Okay. Hey. 
wait for him to pop up because that one always gets me. There he is. Alright, so I gotta see if we're there. I think we need to get to that inner east hall. He's not moving. Shit, I was hoping to go in that center chainer chamber. Inner West is where we just came from. Inner East. Nobody even over there, but okay. It's all of them. Neil, Ash. Ah, oh, shit, they got Neil. She's so hopeful. You there! You have committed treason against Skyrim and its people! Travis?
Oh, sad. Hold on. Hold on. Let me fix it for you. Oh, wrong thing. My bad. My bad. That was the wrong thing to do. Mm -hmm. And is this one? Yep. One second. That should be better. Is that better? What do you mean? That's the game. Yes. A voice from the light. The dawn of mankind has triumphed over the oldest conflict. They are something from nothing. You must not allow them to be extinguished. Alright, well, I guess we're going to walk this. Now we're going to go up the stairs. Oh, shit! Oh. Uh, hello? I'm glad you remembered where I was. Do I know you? We've spoken many times, Sal. Alright, are you gonna be as cryptic as the voices? Hold on, Jim? I was once well apart. Well part of me was. I've made many sacrifices to get here, and I've lost so much along the way. I guess that's a yes on the cryptic thing, then. I'm so sorry about your family, Evelyn, Larry, Lisa. Yes, I used to be as well. There was a time when I thought I could save them by changing the future. It was all I wanted. Lisa and Larry were the light of my life. I had never known such deep love. I do not hold you responsible for their deaths. I understand that what had to be done. You lost a lot that day, too. But it is the nature of life. All living things must come to an end. Remember what it is like to live, to feel. I do not miss the constant clad of emotions. It was all for nothing, though. The shadows still live, and the devourers are going to call forth the plague. Oh, shit, so now there's going to be a plague.
Their reach has grown too far. I stopped nothing. I died for nothing. I killed for nothing. Oh, and are you still there? Okay. I was just about to put in the chat if you were still here. I'm starting to get hot now. You can still stop them if you wish to. In fact, you are the key to their destruction, if that means anything to you for now. Is this that prophecy nonsense again? I don't think I'm much of a chosen hero. I couldn't save anyone. There's still no chosen heroes. Only those who chose to do heroic acts. Win or lose, light or dark, good or evil. These things don't hold much significance to me anymore. But I would still like to help you if you choose. How can I do anything like this? Upon dying, your soul was shattered. This occurrence has awakened a unique ability within you. You will be able to drift into parallel worlds, though it will take some practice. How do I get back to my world? It will be difficult, but I have prepared your arrival. I built a device to help you. Your friend Ashley has gathered the device above your grave in your world. This is good. However, there are more components, and they must be aligned across the three realities that they have been hidden in. The three pyramids of Astema, I'm not sure if I said that right, are each sealed within three puzzles. You must gather them all. If you hid these three pyramids of Ashenma, or whatever, can't you just grab them for me? That is not possible. I can no longer intervene in such matters. I have also erased the solutions from my memory in case anyone tried to steal them. However, I can guide you to their locations. Okay, well, that will save some time at least. Where do I start? There must be a door here. Just a second. Um, there it is. You'll find your way through that door. Keep your wits about you. Bye, Jim. Downstairs. Alright, we're gonna go to this door. You know we're gonna go through door two. I'm guessing we're going through the light now. First. Oh, Dad. I'm afraid moving still isn't an option for us. The house has been on the market since, well, four years now. It's an important step that I hope you will be able to take soon. In the meantime, I believe that the cat will be a great comfort to Sal. He's shown a lot of improvement over the last month after he was assigned the kitten. Are you sure he's ready to come home? He is more than ready, Henry. Are you sure you're ready? Yeah, it will be good to have my son back. Okay, so Gizmo was like a therapy kitten. What the hell? Well, this isn't what I was expecting. You have awakened a new soul connection. You may find it a bit strange at first. Actually, it feels pretty natural like I've been here the whole time, like waking from a dream. In the beginning, I found the odd sense of familiarity to be unsettling, but I am not like you. You'll find the first pyramid somewhere in this house. Oh, wait. Okay. Sealed shut. This way? Nope. Alright. Oh, this is my bedroom from 
when we moved out. Wait. I don't like that. There's another one. Three, two. I'm not sure what those are for, but I keep finding them. There's us four. There's Todd. Can't remember the girl's name. I think it was Ash, Sal, and Larry. Basement. It's jammed shut. Because we they was keeping demons in there, bro. There's a little blood on the floor. Seven eight four two. Said it's somewhere in this house. I'm guessing. What was these numbers? Seven eight four two. I'm guessing yeah that's what I was thinking but there's only three of them 145 there we go Well, I turned them. I'm guessing that undid Todd's room. Okay. You remember what the numbers were? 7842, I think. Yeah, 7842. Dun 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 dun. Okay, then. It's not that either. Then did the padlock. Thing really there. Still jammed shut. So the last one was a three, this one was a two. This unlocked the padlock. So 
so I'm sorry I didn't believe you before. I wanted, I really wanted to. I tried so hard to be there for everyone. And now it's all falling apart. I hope it was not too late to fix things. And mistakes, I need to know that. It just ends there. Something interrupted her. Uh, I don't see anything. Let's see. One, three, two, one, two, three. One, three, zero, one, zero. Zero one zero. Oh, shit. Scared me. just for those I am I do I do for those because then I'll be stuck on them for a few hours especially if it's not something that's very obvious Sal give me, give me a kiss what do you want wait you want a hug when you want. You came over here and started giving me an attitude. You give me a kiss. You go in the trash can. You want me to give you a trash man? Want me to eat you? You don't know. You want in the bed? Die say you want him. Good girl. Mm -hmm, yeah. Good girl. Good girl. Yeah. Oh, it's your baby. Oh. Oh. It's your baby. You want in the bed with Aura? Come here. Aura. This is all the people that Sal killed. Except for Larry, Larry, Odeed. I meant not Odeed. Yeah, thank you, Odeed. Pyramids of Astama to be raised around a corpse. These symbols are some of code, but where are they? So I'm guessing. Wait, what? I don't. One. Wait, hold on. Let me see, because I don't understand what this is saying. So, internet salves grave. Okay, got the code. Wait, what? Okay, don't tell me how to do it. 
So I'm guessing this one, this one, this one, this one, this one, this one. So this one, this one, this one, this one, this one, this one. Oh, okay. Oh, so we have to do the patterns. Okay, okay, I got that, I got that. You did it, Ash! Oh, back here again. Well, to the next one. Of course, Sally. Ain't like that. Go get him. This is what I'm doing. Alright, now into the darkness. Oh, well, we already did that one, so I guess we gotta go. Oh, three. Okay, okay. Three! Woo, that's loud. Alright, me and Sal. Oh, it's giving backstory of Sal. Dad, when will Mom get out of the hospital? Do you think she'll recognize me with my new face? God damn it, Sal, can we not do this today? I just miss her. She's dead. She's fucking dead. Mom isn't coming home. What about the man with the dog face? We've been over this. Nobody believes me, but I did see the dog man. That's enough, Sal. I chose the pink one because that's mom's favorite color. I hope she will recognize me with it on. <sighs> okay, so now we're like in a... I've been looking for this spot. I spent so much time out in these woods searching for some evidence that it, this was real, that I wasn't losing my mind. The council went to the great lengths to cover it up. They had hidden it with a concealing spell, as they called it. Of course, they consider magic is merely science that they don't understand. That makes sense, though I have to be honest. It's a pretty dreary way to explain magic. Anyway, I'm guessing you have some hidden things of your own around here, yeah? The second pyramid is here. Okay. Dun, dun. Oh, okay, so I can actually move. What are these things back here? No, because you're not. Hey. Oh, now your hair's all fluffy. What do you want, fluff butt? What do you want? You want me to eat you? I'll eat you. No, oh, okay. That's what you want. Why you gotta do this? Hmm? Da 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 da. You need some love for a minute. Mm, yeah. Mm. Mm. 
This ain't a, this is a game I can play with you in my lap, so you can chill here until I gotta play another game that you can't stay in my lap for. You got that? You got that? You taste so good. Here, so you don't fall out of my lap. Uh, oh. I don't know what that is, but okay. Why are you getting mad at me? I didn't do anything. I didn't do anything. Why are you getting angry? Do that. Moon sun. Oh. Why are you getting mad at me? I can't. Ma'am. Ma'am. Do I look Papa impressed? I am. Not Papa impressed. Want me to do your hair? I'll do your hair. Oh, 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 what, what do you want? Okay. What is this big mound? Why you why you want do I need to get off for a little bit and come love you? Is that what's wrong with you? You need some kisses? Mommy finish this game. I think I'm close to them. Okay, so there's like a little pad over there. There's a three pad here. Oh, so it's moon, moon, sun, 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 moon, moon, sun, moon. Okay, that's easy enough to remember. Child, I am not a climbing post. Thank you very much. Mm-hmm. I said it. I'm not climbing post. Okay. So moon, moon, sun, sun. Moon, sun. Or was it sun, sun, moon, sun, moon, moon? Maybe it's that one. So light, light, dark, light, dark, dark. Light, light, dark, wait, dark, dark. Hey! Now we just gotta find the other ones. Oh, stuck on a tree. A rock, sorry. Uh, moon, moon, sun, 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 moon, moon, sun, moon. Where back can I go? Okay. Da 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 da. Okay, so as far as I can go over there. I did this one. Okay, 
Okay, now I'm really confused. Oh god, I'm stuck. There we go. So, blank. I'm confused. What? Okay, so spots. It said one was like back here or am I misunderstanding I don't know where these pieces are ah there's one Okay, now I know where it is. Okay, that's the color board. Moon, moon, sun, 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 moon, moon, sun, moon. I got his skin. I got his mu I got his muscle. Another one lit up, Sal. Keep going, Ash. I'm getting stronger. You don't look so great, Sal. I'm gonna figure this out. Let's get you back. Maybe the other one? Uh. This one's difficult. Ding. Ding. Ding.
Now you gotta go through door four. At least I think there's a door four. Yep. Go in! Are you ready for your first day at school, Sally? I don't know. It'll be fun. You'll get to meet a bunch of kids your age and make lots of friend new friends. But what if they don't like me? That's impossible. You're the coolest guy I ever met. Me? Of course. I don't want to leave you, Mommy. You don't have anything to be afraid of, my love. The teachers will take good care of you. And I'll be right here when you get back. I love you. I love you the most, Sally. Don't forget it. Oh, shit. This is the cave at the Wendigo Lake. I don't remember it being so big. Another illusion created by your favorite cult. Whoa. Was that a joke from Mr. Sirius? No, it is me, Jim Johnson. Uh, okay. I'm gonna go find the last pyramid. Godspeed. People... Hello? Whoa, back off, dude. I'm tougher than I look. I'm af not afraid to out you down. Put you down. Hey, I'm not here to cause any trouble. I'm just looking for something I lost. Aren't we all? Well, you better not try anything. I'm watching you. Promise you I won't. My name is Sal. Tala Greg. So what are you doing in these caves, Sal Fisher, besides sneaking up on people? I was just about to ask you the same question. I don't think I've ever seen you around Knockfell before. My relatives are from here. I don't visit too often, but my grandfather has recently gone missing. Unfortunately, that tends to happen a lot around here. I hope you find him. Thanks. My grandfather was fascinated by these caves. He used to tell me that our ancestor made all these paintings. He said they depicted a warning of hungry beasts that hunts humans in this land. Have you seen a small metal pillar at Amanda Loud? A small metal I'm guessing. Blah, blah, blah. I haven't seen anything like your own thing here. I saw it. What about some Tony hexagons? You're just a. I'm a bad guy looking for a bunch of shapes, huh? It's a prosthetic. Well, I'm sorry. I couldn't be more help with your geometry. <laughs> The light, the dark, half angel, half demon. Hey, look, it's your mom. Ha 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 ha. The dark side has the triangle. This one's gonna be tricky.
don't understand what's happening, but the third one is activated now. This will bring you back. My ghost will be able to interact, but my body cannot be revived. Are you sure the prophecies are vague? But they suggest that you will take physical form. I'm not sure of anything. Alright, let me take care of this last pyramid. Bam! Okay, so... Black, white, black, white, black, white, black, white, black, white, white, black, white, white. <laughs> Damn it, this was supposed to resurrect you, are you okay? It hurts. There's another part to Todd's notes, but I haven't been able to make much sense of them. I'm so sorry, Sal. I've failed you again. You deserve better than this. You deserve better than me. Wait, I think I know what it means. I know what I have to do. I would gladly die if it means that you will live. This is how I can make up for everything I messed up. No. Go save them, Sally Face. I hope we meet again. Oh my gosh! Can it just stop? Does the dying ever stop? Larry, are you okay? Yeah, dude, I uh, just got something in my eye. I told you this movie is emotional. It's just so beautiful. I hope they end up together in the end. They deserve happiness after all the shit they've been through. Yeah. Hey, Larry. What's up? Do you, do you think that anyone would ever love me like they love each other? Who wouldn't love you? Don't be stupid. You're Sally Face. You're perfect, dude. Oh, dude. Of course, Neil can move in. I'm surprised it took you so long to ask, honestly. His current lease is nearing its end now, which is why I waited. I'd be happy to have him at our place. I'm sure Larry will too, though Larry probably won't move in until next year. Right, well, thank you. Neil will be excited to hear the news, and I will be very glad to have him close by again. Ugh. What's wrong, Sal? I'm just no good at this. I'm sorry for wasting your time. You've got nothing to apologize for. I've been having a great time painting with you. You're an amazing artist, Ash, and wonderful teacher. I'll never be as good as you, though. Sure you can. All it takes is practice and determination, but only if you want it, you know? You don't need to be good at everything you do. Some things we do just because they're fun, and like we like doing them, or even just to spend time with people we like. I guess you're right, and I have been enjoying this time together very much so. I'm glad to hear that. Anytime you want to paint or even just hang out, you let me know. Ashley? Oh, all the people he killed. Where's Larry? I don't see Larry. Oh, my stomach. Ashley, I wish you would have seen yourself the way I did. You weren't a failure in my eyes. You were always there for me. You gave me hope when I needed it most, even when you saw the horrible things I had done. Even when you couldn't believe the reasons I had to do those things, you stood by me. That means everything. The ritual requires one final step. Seize the power of the blade of or Osiris. Okay.
What's happening to me? The voice is self here. Sure. Ash, can you hear me? So, where are you? The ritual has awakened the power within my being, but I cannot return to your world. You must be my sword in the darkness. This power... This power I feel. This is you? Yes. Holy shit, Sal. Yeah, tell me about it. Oh. <laughs> yeah, that's what I just said. I'm sorry, I gotta readjust. You're making my legs fall asleep. You're so damn sweet. Thank you for trusting me with this. I couldn't have attained this power on my own, Ash. It's all thanks to you. Let's go kick some cultist ass! You know we straight up gonna murk all them. Or are they gonna do that capture shit? Where is everyone? Oh, I can't break the door down? So the doors are for sale. Oh. For our what? 
for our stillborn daughter, though I haven't found hard proof of that. Now they're planning whisper. Well, that's good to know. Uh, Archie Shop Kenneth. Phelps, we've been expecting you. What have you done? The final destination upon us on this night. Mankind will triumph over God. You killed them. How many others are destined to be so much more than? Shut the hell up, you psycho. I'm gonna end you. I thought you might feel that way at first. Oh shit, now we gotta go kill him. Oh! Oh, oh, I forgot it was R. I kept pressing enter. Whoops. Yeah, come on. Come on, you ain't taking my homies. Oh, shit. This won't take a minute. Kill my friends! You know what? Alright. Oh. What the hell? I didn't die, did I? Todd? Don't worry, we're gonna get you out of this. Sal, is that you? Who the fuck is that? Larry's dad? I didn't think I'd ever see you again. What happened? When the treehouse burned, I was lost in the void. I spent so long there, dude. Like, really long. I, I can tell I like the beard, though. Eh. But, yeah. There was this weird tree. The roots were cosmic-y. And stuff. Creatures gathered around and worshipped it. They called it the mother tree. I'm still not really sure how it helped me find my way back. I think I've seen that or felt it before. You're connected to it. We all are. Larry, about Lisa, I... Dude, you don't need to say anything, I know. But I... It's okay, seriously. All of their souls would have been destroyed. I'm glad your soul didn't dissolve in the void. Not yet, at least, though. Todd was right about the whole second death thing. Souls fade into the void and become nothing. It sounds brutal, brutally final, but it didn't learn much beyond that. Do you know how we can save Todd? I think we can get him out. I'm surprised he's lasted this long. He always had was had a strong will. Oh, I have something for you. I found it in the void. I didn't notice the body in the middle. What? Wait, wait, wait. I didn't know he was supposed to fight. Eat my ass, you red-eyed bitch! Oh, son of a cunt. Oh, 
Okay, so Todd, I'm guessing, I'm guessing those four were the sacrifice. And Todd's like, barely left alive to be corrupted. We gotta save Todd, yeah, we definitely gotta save Todd. Like, his boyfriend was killed and all kinds of shit. His friends, his boyfriend. Let's go. Oh, that's what's his name. I won't let you do this. Your betrayal is not surprising. You always were a disappointment. Ooh. The feeling is mutual, you fucking prick. You know you can't stop this, son. Bet. Trannies! Ashley, get out of here now. It can't end like this. We have to. We. I have to. Right, you Todd, hold on, buddy. Oh, Pixel Sally. Woo! Moves a little too fast for me to react to it. Oh, shh. How, how did it hit the other one but not hit the other? Okay, whatever you say, game. Come on. I can't see the game. It's black screen. Oh, okay, there we go. Anger has come upon me. I didn't know it was going to come from the bottom. Turn the right way. Start running at that part.
right, let's save y'all. Oh shit, I forgot. I didn't know who I was playing as. Either way, I should have pressed R. Which one's coming first? This one. We are everlasting. Excuse me. Oh, so I can do like... <coughs>
shit. We can't save the ones that have been dead, but we can at least save Ash and Todd. And a Sally face. Man, that was that was a rough one, guys. Like, that was rough. Even for me, that was rough. Well, you gonna go somewhere? Or, or do you want mommy to come love on you for a minute? I guess that's my answer. You want mommy? Alright. Well, I shall be back in about, I'll say an hour. I gotta eat too. Um, of course, not sure what we're gonna be playing. Let me see if the other game downloaded. We're gonna be playing A Plague Tale Innocence. So, that's what we're gonna be doing. Uh, as for that, I'll see y'all in about an hour.